Hey guys, what's up? Today we're going to be talking about favicons. Favicons is the icon that's on your browser tabs. As you can tell, there's a favicon here, here, and this actually doesn't have a favicon, which is kind of weird. This is a favicon generator, and their own website doesn't even have a favicon, which is pretty odd. Anyway, um, for everyone that has this, this actually goes out for the people that have the view layout. Um, the view layout is something that we came out a little while ago. It's a music layout for everybody that has a, an account with us. It's a free layout. Um, and one of the things that, um, that people have been asking for is how do you change the favicon? Because this is the default icon for the tab. And as of, um, as of yesterday, I guess, there was no way to change this at all, so you're kind of stuck with our logo. But now things are different. Now we've been able to. Now we're you're able to change the icon. So uh, let's go ahead and show you how how that's done. What you want to do is you want to log into your your panel, and then which see here. Then you want to do is go into your view tab, go to general settings. And then you want to go to the upload favicon. Okay. Uh, at this point, I already have a favicon made. In a little bit, I'll show you how to generate one. So go ahead and just, uh, I'm going to choose the file. And then I'm going to use the, uh, I have one here. Just open that up. And then I'm going to hit submit. Okay, six, uh, looks like it's done successfully. So I'm going to go to my view layout and I'm going to refresh. Now, now it's a cool little like little record button that uh, it used to be, uh, it used to have this on there, but now I changed it to, to that. So that's, that's something that's really cool. Um, <laughs> uh, a lot of people have been asking for it. So now you're able to do it. So um, for, for many of you that don't know too much about the favicons, um, it's not like you can upload a graphic. This is a graphic of some sort, but you can't upload a JPEG or a bitmap or anything like that. Uh, for, for all of you that know already how to, use, how to upload or how to create a favicon, you're pretty much done with this tutorial. You can just close out the video, create one, upload a favicon now. But for all those that don't know how to upload one, create one or upload, uh, stick around. What I would do is, uh, the first thing I would do is I would just look for um, an icon, um, uh, look for an icon that's 16 by 16 uh, pixels wide. For example, you can go to uh, iconfinder.com, uh, a favicon of a star, so you can just put in star, and search for a star, and then what you want to do is you want to drop this down to 16 by 16. Go to free. And say you want this one. What I just do is just right click, save image as, and then, um, you know, save it to your uh, desktop. And then in the generator, what you want to do is you want to take that file that you just uh, saved, just choose file and upload the, um, the PNG that you downloaded and then just create the favicon. What you can also do is uh, if you have your own logo, which a lot of you already do, you can create, you can go into Photoshop and take your logo and really, favicons are really small. So I would just take your logo and uh, open up a new document um, and make it uh, 16 by 16 pixels and drop your logo in here okay and then once you have it in there take it into the uh the favicon generator and it, it will generate your logo um, from 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 this uh, once you once you um have it created and download it then you go back into the control panel and you just upload the uh, the file here it will have a dot ico extension and you'll be good to go. 
so that is uh that's pretty that's pretty much it i mean it's kind of cool to have your own little uh brand and uh icon uh on your view page so hope you guys enjoy and uh we'll talk to you later bye